be like this. I get that their creeds mean a lot to them both. But isn't that all the more reason for them to try to understand each other? But instead, they resort to fighting without even listening to each other first. How can they be like this? Yeah, I don't want them to fight either. But I, you don't hear me whining like a little bitch. <laughs> Is it about why I think so intent on killing that dragon? That's part of it. What I can't figure out is what he means when he says that killing can also save someone. And how he's not the one with the curse. Maybe he feels pity for Theodora. And how she's doomed to keep on living as a dragon. Yeah. What does it really mean to live? <sighs> this topic sure got deep fast. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, we leveled up a bunch of times, wow. so he was probably way over leveled for us. Jackalus outfit for Aizen. Oh! Wait, didn't we have that already? No. Also, Expedition? We didn't, so let's go see what it looks like. Oh, surprisingly normal. Oh, hey. He kind of looks like a bootlegger in the 1930s. Yeah, a little bit, especially with the top hat. Right? Also, Expedition! Ah! Expedition? We're almost level 60 from just doing some quests. Oh my god. I think we were like around level 50 when we started. <laughs> <laughs> our Tori is probably thinking our dumbasses are going to arrive at level 50. We're just like, no, we're all super buff. <laughs> we're all just super buff, including Lafacet. <laughs> Lafacet's like Lafacet's tiny little head on the super buff body. Yeah, he's taller than everyone else. <laughs> oh, whoops. Here I come. No, I don't like these. Oh, no. oh my god. I was not this strong against them before. You can't fool me, little bitch. No! No! It's not supposed to be like this. Oh man. I'm embarrassed. Oh damn. Oh. Ended my life. Thank you, sirs. I'm so embarrassed. I die twice. I will die twice. Seek revengeance. My spear can cut a path through anything. My penis can cut a path through anything. What? Is, oh, I didn't need this in my life. Oh man. I'll finish this quick. No, I didn't want to do this at all. Them that time. Yeah! Spin, spin! Stretchy, stretchy! Oh my. Yeah! Get out of my life. Spin, spin! Stretchy, stretchy. It doesn't have to be like this. Alright, is that. <laughs> no, it's not it, but. <sighs> Do we have any fucking. Are we gonna continue that subquest or what? Of course, it's not gonna fucking tell me where it is, right? Where we gotta go next? Ugh. Okay. No, it, it. There we go.
so it's not Marishio. Do I have to fucking teleport all around again to finish that subquest? Oh my god. Holy crap, I'm gonna save first. I guess start at the beginning and go back around, yeah? Um, I think we're good, honestly. Yeah. yeah. We'll finish that one later. Yeah, I'll just look up the side quests when we're done. And... Oh, wait. Uh, oh, finish up the... The Zavid one. Oh, the Zavid clearly one? not done. Yeah, well... <sighs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, we should check around one more time. Because we got so far in it. Yeah. God damn, this fucking thing. Why is it like this? I don't know. I'm getting better at it though. I'm getting quicker. Um... We still- I think we can also challenge that, uh, swordsman guy, the dragon swordsman, and then, uh, come back too. Cause we gotta turn it in. That's true. So I definitely suggest we do that. Definitely. Just in case there's like another one. Nope. Where are we, Lurgus? Or, yeah, we're at Lurgus. Nope. And let me go grab some more bottles, since like merchant guys like right the fuck here. I might as well grab more of these too. And some more. bottles. Yeah, that's everything. This is we need, right? yeah. We need. Oh, I know. Yeah. We no. is where the little sick kid is. Yeah! Oh, man. Hey. The boss has a request for you. What? Not a message, but a request. Beat up a dragon. The Whitehorn dragon has been showing up in the Aldina Plains. Yeah. The boss wants you to kill it. Since when did the Bloodwings become agents of justice? Interested in protecting the world from dragons? Hey, we're not out to save the world. This is just to put an end to Zavi's madness. Did the beat do something in particular? He's been harassing exorcists, trying to get more information on that dragon. That's got the Abbey on alert, which makes trouble for us. Our spies in the Abbey can't operate under these conditions. And that's where we come in. Does that mean the beat is in the Aldina Plains too? Got it in one. Just be careful. Zavid and that dragon are even more agitated than usual. Let's go. Are you gonna fight Zavid again? Yeah. Time has come. The time has come. Alright. Uh, it's this way. No, wait, it's this way. It is this way. Hey! This is the Aldina Plains, right? No, it's not at all. It's not at all. Where the hell are the Aldina Plains? What? I don't know what that Just means! Check in the subquest! Oh, right. <laughs> Where the hell am I? Oh my god, that's so far away! Why is oh, that's, this that's where we originally fought him. Oh. Well then, if that's the case, we'll go to Stonebury. I like how they give you no fucking clue where to look. Let me see. Uh, yeah, if we would like to continue this up quest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, why person. the fuck would you go to Renid if you know they're gonna show up in the Aldina Plains? You go to Stonebury. And we went to a bunch of other towns first, and they weren't My there. My guess is, is this is also trying to follow the story, maybe, and we just missed, like, one part of it. You know? Oh, maybe we're supposed to follow it along with the story. Mm -hmm. And I just got super hyped up. Yeah, you're probably right. I'm gonna go, because this teleport us closer. Maybe. Remember. I think we, no, I think we took it last time. It was, like, sort of closer. Yeah. Yes. So it is on the mountain peaks, though. So you did say Aldina Plains, so I'm just like... Yeah. I'll just make sure it's on the peak before we, like, you know, go all the way up there. Yeah. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Stretchy, stretchy. The fucking Tifa. That's Magilu's. Is that thing she says? Mm-hmm. I was so disappointed last night because I was grinding up the little hoverboard points and like getting to the the point where you couldn't run over the monsters and then going, oh shit, now I have to fight them, fuck. 
Uh-huh. It's like, eh. Uh, so much more satisfying to run over them. Oh yeah, it really is, honestly. It's super satisfying in this game. I wish it gave you something. Like some cat souls, maybe. Yeah, or just something. A random item. Yeah, like little, like little gathering point items. Yeah, or some, yeah. Like, oh, here, you got a copper thing. Yeah. That'd be neat. They'd be pretty swell. Swell. <sighs> Alright. That would be a Zavid and a dragon. That boss fight was so easy. Toothless! Toothless! Oh my god. I wonder where Zavid might be. He's trying to get a, like, stick out of her mouth or something that she ate. Look! It's the beat of the dragon! Eudora! Aw, oh, man. <laughs> this takes me back. I remember the first time I tried to talk to you. You smacked me pretty good then, too. Aw. <laughs> oh man. Man, that hurts. <laughs> you sure don't know how to hold back, do you? <laughs> oh, shit. The bead. Just watch. What? So, you're just waiting for me to die so you can help yourself to her heart. Is that it? Sorry, but that's not happening. I'm not dying here, and I won't let you kill her. I'll decide what I do, Zavid. <laughs> dragon wouldn't hesitate to attack a child, or the man who risks his own life to protect it. <laughs> Tell me, Zavid, who is this white horn dragon? <sighs> you said that your creed was to never give up on living, no matter what may happen. If you really believe that, would you say that you're living right now? Oh. Oh. <sighs> Because to me, you don't look like someone truly living. Can you take the fucking gun? Yeah. The hell are you saying? I understand now. Aizen really isn't the one who's cursed. By killing Theodora, he's actually saving... Zavid. It's time to lift this curse. Aww. Aw, oh, sucks. All oh, the music! Watch out for the malevolent sloppy set. You too, Ivan. Dragon types are good against dragons. That's true. Thank you, Pokemon. <laughs> I don't know where I am, but I'm kicking this dragon in the face. You get your butt out of the screen. Brock, eat it! Ready to die? Think you can dodge? It's so big! Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> so, like, like the sad guitar music in the background. Whoa. What the fuck? It's there we are. Oh, 
Oh, no spells. Eleanor, why? Oh, man. I need to revive. Oh, God. He's coming after me. I'm gonna throw you a thing. Thank you. Cool. Okay, I'm getting out. Thank you. Stop it with that. Help something because I don't want to die right if she's dead. Good plan. Oh shit, I'm dead. Oh god. Yeah. Yay! Woo! Easy. Easier than expected. Theodora, get wrecked. Kill her. If you kill her, if you kill Theodora, I'll never forgive you, Ivan. I know. <laughs> oh, man. Ivan, how could you? Oh, shit. What? Why didn't you break your reaper's curse? What? Did you want me to eat its heart? Don't answer a question with another question. <laughs> the reaper's curse is mine to bear alone. The danger of becoming a dragon, however, is a curse upon all Malachim. All that malevolence. It's going to take its toll on you, too. Yeah, I can already feel it starting. It won't be long before I wind up like her. You'll have to leave your pirate buddies before things turn ugly. I'm the first mate on Eifried's ship. So, to be honest, it's probably just as well. I'd rather end up a dragon than have this curse hijack my ship and my life anymore. <sighs> but I do fear one thing. I'm afraid that when I turn into a dragon... I could end up hurting the very people I want to protect. Theodora couldn't even recognize anyone she loved anymore. You saved her, Eisen. By killing her. 
Before all this, Theodora was a kind woman. She never wanted to hurt people, and she loved them more deeply than anyone I've ever known. Yeah. Sometimes to kill someone is to save them. Mm -hmm. You have someone you're trying to protect too, don't you? My little sister. What's she like? <laughs> She's oh. like an early blooming flower. Wise for her age. She's got it all together. <laughs> Sometimes has to treat me like I'm the kid. She cries too easily. But deep down, she's so strong. Sounds like someone I'd like to get to know better. Who knows? Maybe I'll even marry her. Sabine, <laughs> don't you worry. I won't make a move until I've killed you. <laughs> Zavide, what are you saying? Consider it revenge for Theodora. I'll be the one who finally puts you out of your misery. <laughs> oh. But I'll only kill you once you've stopped being yourself. Only then. You sure? Yeah. I swear by my true name, Filk Zadea, Zavid the Oath Keeper. Aww. Ufemi Wexu. That's my true name. Oh, I'll man. I'll remember it. This sucks. How do you Is spell that? <laughs> there must be something besides turning into a dragon or getting yourself killed, right? In the end, what matters isn't whether we get killed or not. It's whether we can take control over the direction of our own lives. That's what it means to really be alive. Stop tippy tapping. Suki. That sounds sad. And hard. And upsetting. And but I understand. And I'm going to live life in my own way, too. Whoa. Uh -oh. Did we record those two lines apart from each other, or what? like two weeks apart. <laughs> Where are you going? Wherever the wind takes me. Just like a fucking burst of wind just throws him into the air. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes. I was just like, oh, I'm so glad I've not had to be a wind seraphim. <laughs> 